what's up YouTube welcome to another video this is my third time recording this because the game has crashed both times but here we are right uh, here's the team right we have a new addition Mike Trout now this card is extremely hard to get if you play this game at all you know that but it's also one of the best cards in the game and a lot of people want this card and although it's a little bit later in the year right most people probably already have it I have uh, taken a long break from this game I got back into it I grinded up I got Tatis mantle did all the live series collections I did enough collections to get Mike Trout so I wanted to show you guys exactly how I got Mike Trout and there is one super super simple way to get Mike Trout it's a showdown the running back showdown so the showdown is very simple right enter this game against Wade Davis on rookie 0-0 zero, zero, you just have to win there's runners on second and third that's very simple then you get your your side missions right where you get enough runs to make up the difference in the final showdown so it could be 0 12 and you could just straight shot it right now if you want to skip to the end or you could go through half of them do this one and then skip to the end or just straight up do all of them right you have options um, if you're a better player you might want to stop like around here take your runs get your run it back player and toss in it, it your best effort at this one if you wanted to you could do this and then just straight shot to the end if you're a really good player right so this showdown would say it takes around 45 minutes to an hour if you go through the entirety right if you, sh if you go right to the end right without accumulate any runs it could be done in 10 15 minutes and there is something very important to note so as you see in my team right Andrew Jones right where can you get this card running back conquest and the running back showdown what else do you notice the community market the showdown that like I said takes 45 minutes to an hour 41,960 stubs and that's that's if you just sell it right away right you get 50,000 if you go through the more time-consuming bit and actually selling it there is one card in particular that you would like to pull um, this is much like the uh, finest packs if you know what I'm talking about the finest packs where you get like five and out of however many there are oh here we go so this Josh hater if you get this card to pop up this is the, the card to take it sells for 68,000 on a sell now and up to 89,000 if you go through the the timely part of selling it right and there's still options right um, probably not as great of options but just find a few right now that's mainly what I'm looking to do um Warren Spawn right 43,000 55,000 Cliff Lee 41,000 to 59,000 um Carlos Gonzalez 40,000 60,000 right there is value within the showdown Luke Roy, 41,000, 58,000. Yeah, this is a super simple showdown for you to make a lot of stubs. I will say, before today, I started with around 90,000, right? I did the showdown eight times. I even kept uh, Mr. Eckersley here, kept him for my main team. All the rest I just sold, right? Then I went to collections, right? I was a little bit behind on Trout. I did not have um, Prime. I did not have Signature. Did not have Awards. I did not have Finest. I ended up just going through, buying all the cards I need, 
just to get there, right? Like Prime, you'll see it here. Some of these cards are expensive, if we're being honest, too. Like, for example, Pablo Sandoval. This cost me 33000 Um, Even, where is he? Johnny Cueto, 30000 Brett Gardner, 30000 Like, I d might not have gotten the best value there, but it, it really didn't matter. Like, I didn't even have to buy any, really. Eckersley was the last one I needed to toss in. So I just did, and I kept it for my team. Um, awards. I had to buy a few of them. Like Felix, uh, Victorino, Jason Hayward. Again, not, not much to spend there, but it got it done. Finest. I had a few I could toss in just from playing the team affinity so conquest yeah that's what, where I got them from so I had to buy a few maybe like 15,000 each so I got me trout I already have this done but like if you're struggling here say you're really close to being done right you need just need Mike trout we're dropping 110,000 by now and 78,000 sell now you could honestly do the showdown twice and have Mike Trout. I think that's very, very cool. And to celebrate, let's open some packs, right? Why not? Since, I again, right? We can just farm these subs back up. If you wanted to just rip packs like this, then that's, that's all you can do, right? No one's stopping you. And the best part is you'll get them all back pretty much, right? So we got a whole bunch of headliners lined up. Start ripping through them. Why not? Hopefully we can pull one of the headliner cards. I doubt we do, but we'll see what happens, right? So far, no luck, right? Getting a few golds. Kelly Jansen and Eloy Jimenez. Still nothing of a diamond tier though. Let's see. Can we pull something worthwhile that might make the team? Randy Rose Arena. Alright. That's nice. Nice 5,000 stubs. Oh, diamond. So I actually played animation this time. National League. Starting pitcher. Live series. You Darvish, alright. Another card selling for 5,000 so now, so. Maybe uh, if I want to, I'll go through and list them up on the community market, but. I could just also put them towards Team Affinity exchanges. Make my job a little bit easier going through those. Another diamond. I'm gonna flip it. Fernando Tatis, alright. Three diamonds so far, though. Love to see it. Um, so we have a decent bit of packs left. Up to set 23 headliners. If we pull a headliner, that'd be pretty cool for the video. Doesn't look like we're having much luck on that, however. Coming towards the end now. Got a few, a few batch left. Still not getting any headliners out of them. Kyle Lewis. Double gold. Chad Green and Sal Salvi Perez. Alright. Ian Anderson. Tanaka. Less than 10 left. George Springer. Free agent George Springer, that is. Um, hopefully, as a Phillies fan, he doesn't sign with the Mets. Uh, that'd probably be the worst case scenario, but uh, anything can happen, right? Whit Merrifield. That 84 overall will help with exchanges. Wilson Contreras. So, this is the last one. Let's see who we can get. Jesus Lazardo. If we're going to get a, f a headliner at all, it's going to be. Future stars Lizardo. 
two in and we got silvers. That's not what you want to see. And last pack, silver. All right. Sorry, though. Knocked almost all my stubs out, but guess what? I'm not that worried because, again, the showdown is all I need to get through. So thank you guys all for watching the video. Follow me on social medias, Twitter, Twitch. Uh, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, expect more in the future. All right. MLB 21. We don't know when it'll come out or if it'll even be on Xbox, which is where my next gen console is. So we'll see. Right. But thank you all for watching. Have a nice day and peace.